Stabbings in a small town stun much of the population of Three Oaks this weekend. Three people there are in the hospital. Another is behind bars. 26-year-old Kevin Kane of Hobart, Indiana, allegedly stabbed his mother, his stepfather, and his brother. Tonight, Kane is being held on three counts of attempted murder. WSBT 22 Suzanne Spencer spent the day in Three Oaks, where sources tell her the family was outside having a good time before things turned violent. Police in Three Oaks and several other departments are trying to piece together just what happened in the 100 block of Poplar, the house right behind me. Several neighbors tell me they've never seen anything like this happen in their neighborhood. The silence is what resonates with residents in Three Oaks. Very quiet. That's why one reason we chose to live here because it's small. About 1,500 people live in town, including Francis Reisenbickler. Oh, it's going to be 30 next year. Oh, my. In her 30 years, she's never woken up to this. What is going on? Village officials tell us 26-year-old Kevin Kane allegedly stabbed his mother, stepfather, and brother. He's in the Berrien County Jail and faces three counts of attempted murder. Three Oaks police are describing this as rare. The town is quiet, usually. <laughs> Robert Suberlack lives right next door and visited with Kane and his family in the past, but he wasn't expecting this. Everybody's real, real nice, and I, I just couldn't, couldn't believe that something like that that ever happened. Police are still trying to figure out a motive. I pray for them. I pray for their recovery and to get things settled. It's unclear yet if alcohol and drugs may have played a role in this case. The Three Oaks Police Department is still investigating alongside Michigan State Police and the Berrien County Sheriff's Department. Reporting from Three Oaks, Suzanne Spencer, WSBT 22 News.